Hi ladies, this is Melanie and I, I wanted to show you what I have done on my travel notebook shabby chic uh, TN thing that I'm trying to make and I need some suggestions maybe and I, I did come out really 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 thick and uh, I don't even know how I'm going to get them all together but anyway let me show you what I have. I have three uh, signatures. This is one of them. This is the last one I did. Um, there's some lace here uh, on the inside. This was a Tim Holtz, uh, I don't know, it's, a, uh, it's not a rub on, but it's got texture to it. Here's some lace here. This is a, uh, uh, I said, what is anything without a shaker card nowadays? So I put a shaker card, but I put this thing behind it, a little die cut, just to give it some, um, but anyway, uh, it's not sealed in the back, a little snippet up here. Okay, um, now I'm going really fast so I can get this done. I put this bag, I, I put, I glued the tag down, and I left this bag where I can put some little things in it, little tidbits of things, and then, uh, draw the string. I thought that was a neat idea. I saw that bag, and I said, well, how am I going to get that in there? But anyway, I did. Uh, I haven't done any stamping yet, but this is just the lace and maybe a few charms. Um, I put this right here. This real shabby stuff. I love it. Uh, and I put a little bit on the bag here. I think I, yeah, on the back when I fold it over, it'll be like that. And then the next page. I didn't do too much. I just made this music envelope with a tag in it here. And I put some trim. Rose that trim on the side. This page here. I got a little uh, fur here. A little snippet fur. And uh, I kind of covered this up by accident, but it says um, one of a kind, and it's glued down. I have these little flowers here. Then so you open it up, and uh, here's the page. And on this one, I just put this doily, but I only glued it down in the center, and the paper clip kind of holding the edge of it. Then this here is as amazing a paper clip, and it opens up my right there, but it's paper clip. Then here's a ledger sheet. Uh, a map, and then this is a, no, I glued it down. I thought it was a belly band, but I forgot I glued it down all the way across. Uh, but you can put things on it and write on it. Here's a paper clip with a camera. Matches the camera here, a little snippet here. And here is um, a little bow here on the side. A little, um, I don't know, was, I think this came from my uh, collection of the, uh, um, that my travel notebook, uh, planner society thing. And this right here was just came with the paper collection, uh, I'm using. And a few other tabs in here. I haven't really done anything with. I put some trim and this lace here on the edge. And then you turn the page. And I have, uh, this little snippet here. Uh, this little bobble and a paper clip holding this on. This on. And then I have some more of that pink trim, some more cotton lace here. You open it up, here's the maps. Uh, left that blank. This is blank. I had something in there, but it won't close with everything in there. I got, it got really thick, ladies. And like I said, here's the one that is a belly band. And um, some of them are blank, and because I haven't done any stamping, and I don't even know what else to add. Uh, I'm just running... When I run across some stuff, here my bag is supposed to be, uh, I put this flower down here, and then I just have this one thing here, and, uh, these pockets here, okay, and that is, this is, I'm calling this my second signature, because I'm putting this in second, alright, this is my first signature, and, um, I put this little thing here, I found, this is, a, I got some medication samples, in this plastic stuff, I thought it was really cool. And I saved the plastic stuff. It keeps resealing. You can open it a hundred times and it reseals. And it, uh, it, it separated in the middle. That it came like that. It was like a field pack and then the information. Really cool. So I saved them. Uh, junk. Uh, see, I see save junk. Okay, anyway, um, paper clip is holding it on. I've got it taped on the back page, so it will stay in here. Then, uh, here's a little concord. It says, uh, be the girl who decided to go for it all. 
And then here's a card here with a, uh, some gold. Um, I used my die cut on this. It was just laying around. I stuck it in there. Um, let's see. I put some trim down here and a belly band. I put these little edges here on my uh, coffee pages. Uh, here's my vellum envelope with a really neat um, band I had. And a little tag in there of sorts. And then I have uh, this envelope that I cut an angle. Calling card. Uh, another vellum envelope. I put this on here. I put this card on here and put some little things on the four corners. Put a butterfly and put the same little four, little dots I used there. Okay, here's some trim too. Layers of trim here. And then some trim here. And then you turn it this way. And I love this applique. It's gorgeous. Oh, there we go. Um, and then I just put this little, um, what do you call it? Card? Um, project share. A project life. And um, up and up. Then here's, this is two layers of lace here. And then, like I said, I put these little pull tabs uh, on my pages here. I put a little wooden token down here. A flower. And I'm not done. I'm, I'm deciding whether to go and stitch some of this stuff as well. It's just tacked down. Some is glued real good. Some is just tacked down. So until I could get to my sewing machine. This I'm going to try to, uh, I don't know. I may have to hand sew it. I'm not sure. Um, based it on. Here's a little doily and a little rhinestone button. Uh, here's a little crown holding the flap down. And um, another little pull tab, a little a wing, and this is the center here. So this is like each one of these have like um, 14 pages. So when you close it, it's 28. So <laughs> that's not even including the the envelopes and this and that. It's just the papers. So I think really my uh, signatures already are two. Uh, one equals two of mine. <laughs> okay, uh, here's this flap here. I put three layers of this pretty lace with the gold on it. I just love this lace. It's really pretty. And I put a little pull tab here. And I put this lace in here. Alright, and then um, and this opens up. I put, here's the other bag. And I put this bow. And it's the stopper to keep this closed and open. I just kind of put it behind it. And then here's some pages that I'm going to stamp on. This here is some more music paper. And it does open up to, on. and this is um, Starcroft something by Bow Bunny. But this side was the music side. And then here's a couple more page tabs. And on this page, I thought this is really pretty. I uh, got on card for the set. It was Vintage Girl uh, paper that I used. And, uh, oh, I'm going to get back into the frame. Here's a little black dress. Here's a bow. It says pretty. And then I just did a little bunch of uh, fabric here, lace here at the corner. Here's some little fabric um, appliques on this vellum piece. I don't have anything in the pocket itself yet. And here's some music. This right here, uh, it was an envelope thing. And uh, it was two layers, so... I put the lace on the inside, and then you can still put something behind it, like that right there. So, that was kind of neat. Um, and on this one, I put a um, metal closure right here. Uh, I love this thing. It says, it's hard to be a diamond in a rhinestone world. <laughs> yeah, that's true for me. Okay, here's a little uh, white flower with a pearl. And you see that little pearl? Uh, I don't know. It was just in a box. And it was just loose. And I was like, oh, I'm going to use it. And uh, I just put this uh, butterfly lace there. I ripped it off something and put it on here. I mean, it was already off something. So I put it on there. Uh, here's a little rickrack on the edge. And some more of that white trim. And a little white tab. Open it. And here's a, oh, here's the, and the white tab goes on the other side with another tab. And it opened, here's a gold bow. I'm sorry, move around so much. Here's a pretty gold bow I tied. 
this opens up and here's a little uh, note thing that go, uh, goes in here library note card uh, that I tape down and this is taped down there to I cut it off so it would fit on the page and uh, that's my signature one and uh, I'm y'all give me some suggestions if you can about what I should put in this plastic sleeve I don't know if I should put sequins gemstones or or something just really pretty uh you know a big snippet or something i don't know think about it y'all let me know give me some suggestions ladies okay so that is uh signature number one you saw number two and this is the third one i, I don't know how i'm gonna put all these together in one book but i'm gonna try really hard that's the next step here's a tag i use this folder and then here's a tag uh cream of paper here's <laughs> I even use the labels that you cut off the top of the papers and I put it right there. I don't know. I was just using everything I could get my hands on. Nothing went to waste. Um, some papers, some trim, another piece of trim here, some uh, pretty floral trim on this edge. Then um, the, I said I got to slow down on this thickness, and uh, but it was already too late. <laughs> I'll put some more uh, pretty uh, trim. I didn't have much of this, but it went with the camera. The colors went so well. And then this opens up. And here's a gold uh, shiny page with some trim on the edge. And on this side, I need to uh, glue that down a little bit more. And uh, this opens up. Oh, there. I didn't uh, leave that. I didn't glue it. Here's a Oh, and I'm going to put some acetate like this in. Um, I have to make my copies on my printer. So I'm going to go back and add some acetate before I sew these together. Mental note. <laughs> make my acetate. Here's my other pages. Here's uh, this one here. Uh, this is all open for a belly band. No, no, it's uh, closed here, but you can just stick the edge in right here. And on the other side, I see what I did with it. Okay, then it just opens up like that. Here's some music paper. Then on this side, uh, you can uh, just stick things underneath there. I left it a little loose there. Some more pages, my bag with a tag in it. And it's not decorated yet. The tag isn't. I just put something in there to remind myself to make a tag. And then I made this flower. Um, I wanted to incorporate the purple. And uh, it doesn't look all that good on camera, but it does look good more in person, I think. I don't know. Tell me if y'all like it. Here's an applique up here. And then here's a beautiful butterfly applique. And then open this up. And I haven't glued these down yet because I like the whole full picture. Look at those bites. Those are cool. And if this is the center, you can see. I need to, I've got to do my sewing and then uh, bind it together. I use this wine. You cannot see it very well. It looks black on the camera. Let me shine the light. Let me show. Let's see. There. See, it's a wine. like my clothes. It's a wine color. Um, and I did two layers of it on here. Uh, one layer just didn't look right, so I did two layers. And then I have this bag, this. Um, I feel like I need to uh, put some more charms and tags in this one, but getting really thick already here's some little lace here uh it matches with the wine color here let's see my end of the bag paper there's another saying that's just clipped on i don't know if i'm going to glue it down or not uh here's the other piece of the um acetate it's got words on it and um here's a little piece down here you open it up here's a piece here and here's a little pull tab for this page with what was left over that I cut off down here. And some paper. A little saying says happy heart, a tag, and the end. Ladies, but look at this. I've got to um, do my stamping, so go stitch on my sewing machine, and then try to uh, put these in uh, together in a cover. On some elastic, all three of them, I don't think that's going to work. Look how big these are. Uh, <laughs> here's the thing. If I put them in the travel notebook like this, 
But look how much. I mean, they're so fat. I don't think I'm going to get all that in one book. And have it look right. I don't. It's just. It's not. It's gonna be wide mouth, and I don't like that look. So, um, Julie, I'm gonna have to talk to you about using two of my signatures because I don't want to break them down. I like the way they are. So you, I'll have to talk to you and see what to do. Uh, I mean, you can squish them, but it's still gonna be this way. Uh, with all the squishing I do, it's still gonna be like that's some good signatures wide. And, uh, so that's a pretty thick book. If none of y'all like this, that's fine. I won't send this in. I'll keep it myself. I like it. This is my first attempt at doing a jump journal. And, uh, I think it turned out pretty good. And I'm, I don't ever feel like I'm done. I mean, I, you guys keep adding and adding and adding. And it's craziness to me. It's like, just keep pacing and gluing. And I don't know. It's a crazy thing doing a journal. <laughs> Uh, let me know your thoughts. Thank you, ladies.